On this episode of God Game, we've got two brothers, Joshua and Suspender. And after these four challenges, we're going to find out who's got more game. Yo everyone, I'm Joshua and I'm Suspender's younger brother. Well, well, his reign of terror is over. Now I got him, I'm going to crush him. He might be good, but this time around he's going down. And I'm taking him down. For real, I think I can I got this. Suspender is going down. Let's go. Yeah, hello everybody. My name is Victor. I'm joining Victor Lajin. Um, I'm a graduate of OEU and I'm here to battle my younger brother, Joshua. He's gonna be a tough one. I hope he actually makes his basket because he's a bad shooter, a very, very bad shooter. <laughs> Let's go. My name is Precious. I'm an entrepreneur. I sell wigs and also dye things. Well, let's not forget, I'm also a town planner. Oh, sorry, a student town planner. So, I'm going to be the judge of the shoot the shot challenge. And trust me, I'm going to select the guy who is shooting the shot better. See, don't come and be giving me cheesy pickup lines, though. My guy has reached me. That's it for that. So, watch out. But first, let's get buckets. For this challenge, both players will have a time frame of 2 minutes to score as much points as they can. A perimeter shot counts as 1 point, a 3 point shot counts as 3 points, a dunk is 4 points, and a half court shot is 10 points. The only rule is that the same kind of shot can't be taken consecutively. What fucking day? Another two. Let's go for three. Three. Let's go. Let's go, boy. Let's go, Alpha. Hi, your belly. For the house. Ah, fuck. Hold day. Boy, hey, come on.
it's time for the 1v1 challenge. The offensive player gets a maximum of 5 dribbles and every basket made counts as 1. The first person to 5 points wins this round. Come on! <laughs> lie, lie! Hey! We don't know nothing. Beginner's luck now. <laughs> it all counts like this. Oh, your head! Damn! Yeah. Come on! Okay. Your first Leo. Hey, you won't kill me. Come on, ask now. <laughs> Come on, ask. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. All day. Come on, that was me. Uh -huh. You're right, see? Hold on, I'm hand correct, I'm. No I'm hand correct, I'm. No <laughs> He passed five. Hey, we will count them. <laughs> you don't need three like that, bro. I did four. Come on. Ha ha. What's going on? I <laughs> nah, soft. Ah ah. If I leave and have me ready first. <laughs> Sweat. <laughs> you are drained. <laughs> See blood all over. <laughs> blood rushing through your veins. No, okay, I made two baskets. Come on. I made two points. <laughs> I mean, like, five, five, one of yeah, no, yeah. no, I didn't take one than five. Yeah, I can't tell it. Yeah, you can take a review. Yeah. I didn't and take yeah, one than yeah, five reviews. You need to work on your everything. Yeah, yeah, brotherly advice. Yes, oh, like, come on, come on. <laughs> you need to work on your. You know, you need to work on your you everything. Know, the, the, the thing is, he's my mentor though, so mm. I don't expect, but. Bring this challenge back in a few months' time. I'll post time. I'll post time. I'll nice post time. Nice <laughs> yes. In this round, the basketball knowledge of each player is tested. They get to answer three questions each. One point for any question answered correctly. If a question is answered wrongly, the other player gets the chance to steal. The player with the lowest point takes the L. Okay. <clears throat> Who is the shortest player in the NBA currently? Then game. You. Shane Ami go answer the question. Ah, I don't die. Um. Shortest player. Can I give you two? No, give me two. You need to be cute. Cute or idiot? Wait, nah. Um. Nah. Ah, fuck. Now, nah, Asari. What? I don't know how many. Can I try? Okay, call it like Um, Chris Paul. Dang, dang, dang. I pick. 
from the media. How many teams is the NBA made of? This is like the cheapest question, and I still don't have the answer to it. <laughs> damn, how many teams is the NBA made of? <laughs> damn, damn. Okay. If I'm to. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> uh, how many? Uh, Sixteen. Double thirty-two. <laughs> I said I want to double it thirty-two. <laughs> the other is actually thirty. Thirty. Ah, they're close now. Mention five active players with fathers that once played in the NBA. Number one, Derrick Rose. Oh shit. Number two, Steph Curry. Number three. Number three. Number three. Number three. Ate Tokupo. Me? Yeah. yeah, all. Okay. Oh, oh God. Number four. Number four. Hmm? Number four. Hmm. I beg in tough, I beg. Number four. Um, oh, Dwight Howard. You know, you people are getting on my nerves. <laughs> number five. Number five. Number five. Um. Mm. Number five. Ja. Ja Morant. That's all, okay. Cap. He lying. I'm more, I'll pass on this one. I'll pass. <laughs> Guy, try your luck now. <laughs> try <laughs> just me. try. Just mention sure one. I, I don't mean Regina Daniels. <laughs> okay. <clears throat> I also pick from the top. Hey, <laughs> who is <clears throat> <laughs> who is the tallest player in NBA currently? Really? Tallest player in NBA currently in NBA. NBA. Okay. The tallest player. Okay. Yes, the ball. <laughs> now, center is going to play. Who is the play center? Ah. Who you know? Oh. Um, ah. I want to talk to me. I remember saying don't retire. <laughs> oh. Um, tallest player in NBA currently. Like Name starts with each. Yeah. I have no idea. <laughs> yeah, I think um, Boban. I swear, I was, I was doing the option. I came to my mind. This one. Yeah. Like, as I am now. Now you did use mic. Yeah. Who has the most triple doubles in the NBA? Uh, I'll go with. One, I'll, I'll go with. Is it Westbrook? Ah, oh, damn. Damn. I love a lie. Name for NBA teams. With an animal in their logo. Are you are you are you, are you kidding me? We team we team that more and day again. Memphis. Mention the name of the animal. I go no no. Mention for NBA teams with an animal with an animal in their logo. Okay, I'll mention the animal in their logo. Memphis, they have wolves. Ah! Oh Jamila again. Ha! Oh my god. Oh come on. Oh no no no! Yeah, I know it, I know it, but I don't have I don't have the old day to think about it. Okay, you know what? I'll, I'll help no no no! I don't help him out. It's a lie. No. Okay. Don't help him out. Oh. <laughs> yeah, they tell you to um, Memphis Grizzlies. Right. 
they have a grizzly bear in their logo um we have um we have ox they have ox in their <laughs> The city the team is based in. Yeah, no. I'll... I'll come on, make this thing easier for us now. I just started basketball last two months. <laughs> yeah, let's go easy. Let's go. Easy. Yeah, let's go. yeah. I've mentioned Hawks. Yeah. So um, what, which other team? Which other team? Um, uh, Miami it has the ring. Which other team? Which other team do we have? Hmm. Who do states don't have an animal? <laughs> oh God! Which other team? I only got two. Okay, I think my time is up. I don't have to do that. Okay. Uh, hey. Number one, Memphis Grizzlies. Number number. Yeah, number two, try. Chicago Bulls. Oh! They get wolves now. Yeah, number three, Miso Tatimba wolves. They get wolves now. Yeah, then number four, man, kill yeah. Number four. Now I choose one. We go boss yet. <laughs> Have you just talked Miami is fire? You know you can be prosecuted for that. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Okay. Um, um, last one, last one, last one. I don't talk about. Okay, no, 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 Atlantic no, no, Hawks. No, 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 no. Are you Hawks? Eh? Atlanta Hawks. Yes, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. Oh, having game of the court is arguably as important as having game on it. The players are about to shoot their shots. Let's find out who makes theirs and who is about to break. Well. For a guy to have game, more yeah. Oh, the guy is guys fine. Oh, well, he has to be fine actually. Then I feel it must not be cheesy, like not using cheesy pickup lines. Not like ah, babe, um, can I take it to the moon? Cause something, something like that. You get a kind of stuff like that. So I feel like he has to be fluent. He has to just be eloquent too. Cause it's not just from using one bad grammar. You get so. Basically, that's it for me. And he has to be composed. Yep. I think I got this. I've taken the L in all the on court game. But I think I have a better life off the court. I'm getting better on the court though, but I think I can do this. I got this. So just watch me in action. Okay. So I'm going to ask you like a couple of questions. Don't people. Don't people. Okay, so let's get to the point. Question one. All right. Imagine we both agreed to be in a casual relationship, but you've now developed feelings for me. I want you to act how you tell me. Like, how are you going to tell me? Let's say you and I now, we agree to be in a casual relationship, like friends with benefits, you get that kind of stuff. Okay, so I developed a feeling. Yeah, okay. you developed feelings for me along the line. So how are you going oh, to tell me? Babe, I already love you. Not be juju be that. Okay, actually that's not it, but <laughs> well, if I'm in a casual relationship with you and then I begin to develop feelings. Uh, I think the best way to do it is just to think about a a subtle way. Come on, friends. For two people to be friends, I think they should actually know each other to an extent. So I you think know it was a no strings attached relationship. Yeah, I would definitely let you know. I already added a string to it. <laughs> so when there's so a string, how how like I'll demonstrate? Tell, okay, like how? so um, hello. I think this. <laughs> this relationship you're beginning to have is making me i'm beginning to feel a bit uncomfortable with mm. it i think we can i want us to step up our game mm. i think i'm beginning to develop that strong feeling for you mm. i know it might sound cheesy or something to you but 
I really just I think we can we actually we can do better than we are doing right now. So and I would like you to give me that chance. Okay. So that's how you can tell me that you want us to upgrade our relationship. Yes, from being just FWB and then I want something real with you. Well. I think that's it. Um well, I don't know. It's not really like getting at me, but well you tried, you tried. <laughs> well you tried. So let's move on to the next question actually. You tried for that. If we had to plan an indoor date for the both of us, yeah. what would the setup for the dates look like oh come on indoor dates yeah come everyone is a foodie just get pizza make sure there's pizza on ground no sure you yeah, i like pizza i don't know ev- almost everyone likes pizza mm. he likes pizza i like pizza i'm sure you like pizza almost everyone likes pizza so mm. there should be pizza get okay get wine and then make sure the environment is actually conducive and then come on. okay if you were to take me to a Nigerian artist concert, Ooh. which artist would it be and why? Assuming you can't even ask me who the favorite artist is, or you, you don't even have the right to ask me who my favorite artist is. So you have to be like, guess who's gonna be my favorite artist? Which artist am I gonna love to go to his concert? Every, I think every lady actually likes. Fireboy and Kiss Daniel, so it's definitely either of the two. Okay, you gotta speak one. Oh. Yeah, you said any Nigerian artist, so it could be either Fireboy, Kiss Daniel. Every every lady likes them, so if Fireboy has a concert, definitely Fireboy. If Kiss Daniel has a concert, so definitely which are you going with between Fireboy and Kiss Daniel? And why? Two of them are loved by all, but I think Kiss Daniel, why? everyone likes him. Every lady likes Kiss Daniel. Are you sure every lady likes Kiss Daniel? Come on, he's loved by even some guys. All ladies no homo. love David though. Almost all nah, ladies. Nah, nah. Most ladies are whiskey fans. Hmm. You. I don't agree with that. FC. Anyways, FC let's man. not go. Let's not go between the Machala FC and OBO fans. <laughs> so let's come back to okay. this. Okay. Okay. So I think it's between Kiz Daniel. Or fire, yeah. Or so I'd like you to so choose one. Come on, Kiz Daniel. All right. Okay. It's between the two. They will still. So, for the fourth question, which is going to be like the last question for this segment. For me? Okay. Yeah, for you. Um, We're both not with our phones. And I had a very short time frame to tell you my phone number, which is 080-38-180-810. So, can you repeat like the phone number I just called? 38 180 310. No. I don't do good with figures, but I think I tried. <laughs> come on. 38 on it. Come. You should give me you should give me an A star for Come for on, it was very, very simple. 38 on it, 310. No. That's true, actually. So it was zero eight zero thirty eight one eighty eight ten. Eight ten. Eight ten. No, I actually yes. I, I heard you wrong. I I heard you wrong. No, you didn't I, hear me. Correct. I probably should have told you to come with that again, but I think I heard you wrong. So, come on, I don't like repeating my number. It's not me. me. So it was nice having Joshua here. Well, Joshua made me feel butterflies in my belly, but no more butterflies. Like butterflies were not erupting. They were just on low key. So, well, talking with Joshua was nice. It was actually nice having him here. He kind of explained himself and told me. Well, he got my question of Kizania, right? Actually, I love Kizania. Like, I would definitely love to go to his concert one day. Well, that's if you take me there, Sha. I don't know. Okay. I think I killed it. Come on, which lady does not like pizza? If you don't like pizza, I want to see your comments under the comment section. Mm-hmm. If you don't like Fireboy, let me see you under the comment section. If you don't like his Daniel, every lady, I think every lady actually likes his Daniel. So far, so good. I'm actually be taking the, the, the W in all the challenges on court and now it's off court. Trust me, I got this. I'm taking this. Like, I'm, I'm, I'm whooping his ass majorly. And I act like I have a couple of questions to ask okay. you. I want to know how good you are with ladies. Like, okay? I'm very shy. Yeah. So, are you prepared? <laughs> yeah, yeah, very, very. I don't pay for the questions. No, 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 no. All. all right. So let's get straight to business. Guy, face fraud. Okay, so 
the first question okay here goes the question imagine we both agreed to be in a casual relationship but you've now developed feelings for me i want you to act how you tell me like let's say we're in um, a relationship like no strings attached all right so um we're just being like friends with benefits you get Right. So, how will you tell me Felix had developed feelings for me? I want to like act it out. Yeah, okay. Uh, <clears throat> okay. The first thing is, I will actually invite you out like this. Let's just assume we're actually outside, you understand? Mm -hmm. Like on a date, I will just make it somewhere public, somewhere you would actually feel okay, you understand? Then the first thing I will do is ask you to order for what you want, you understand? When we're now mm -hmm. done eating, I will now tell you, let me start. I'll be like, okay. Um, hello. Um, precious. Mm. It's actually been a while we've actually been seeing each other, eh? Yeah? Mm. I won't lie to you. I know we actually agreed on mm. going slow and and but for me actually things actually started speeding up and I started having mixed feelings. And I won't lie to you, I started seeing you with other guys and I started getting jealous. I actually love spending time with you, you know? Mm. So I actually Googled it. And I noticed I actually love you. I saw it today. Oh my God! Wow! Oh my God! <laughs> like this got me, bam. So, <laughs> I don't know if we can actually move to the next stage. You know? Wow! At your speed. Anyhow. Wow! Wow! I was actually expecting that. Oh my God! <laughs> okay, before I blow up, like, please let's move on to the next question. <laughs> all right so question two so this is actually very simple it's just very okay. simple if you have to plan an indoor date mm -hmm. for the both of us okay. what would the setup for the date look like okay 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 i think if it's actually going to be an indoor date and you know what i actually still want her to be at our best so i'll actually order um an uber to actually go get her at her address you know then inside that Uber, and there will be a package like just a gown, something light. Oh, no. Then I would get out about my place. Trust me, the bed well laid, dimmed lights, hmm. nice movie to watch. One hmm. love and romance. My nigga. <laughs> Sounds like an erotic and steamy <laughs> night. <laughs> no, 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 chill, chill. But then um i will give room to the snacks because i don't want us to actually start eating then later on if we actually want to order i think that will be the best indoor with games of course maybe like mm. scrabble or i know i will just get out what she wants either scrabble what or you do you know i think that's my own best idea of indoor well 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 that was safe let's move on to the next question okay so question three uh-huh if you were to take me to a Nigerian artist concert, uh -huh. which artist would it be and why? Considering that I don't actually know your favorite. Yeah, you don't know my favorite actually. Hmm. <laughs> I will actually choose the video. Ah, <laughs> huh, Obio. Hmm. I don't know. I just feel Obio is actually the number one, like the chillest. Um, celebrity like you know that music channel that you actually want to chill with yeah his squad are actually the top notch he chill well i said i just feel they will be the best option let's move on to the fourth question all right okay all right so this is the last question and it's very very simple trust me it's very simple okay we're both not with our phones and had a very short time frame to tell you my phone number mm -hmm. I mean, we're born with our phones mm -hmm. and had a very short time frame to tell you my phone number okay. which is 08038 so can you like repeat the phone number to me 08038 wow 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 <laughs> you actually like got that okay i should have <laughs> i should have I should have just been like zero eight zero three eight one eight zero something like just call like that. So it's not yeah. that it's very simple. But well, you got it actually. Well, you got it right. So thank you, Suspenda. Thank it was you. actually nice having you here. Well, with Suspenda, it actually turned out nice too, just like you did with Joshua. So 
Well, it was very, very free. It was very, very, very clear. He stated his intentions in clear terms. So, well, I'm kind of finding it out to pick right now, but I'll be picking later, Sha. Yeah, so far, so good. I actually, I feel I actually have a good chance with that, you know? I got the number right. That last part is mind blowing. Please comment about that. <laughs> and then um, I think she was actually smiling all the way. So I feel I got this. So, guys, welcome back to Shoot the Shot Challenge. So now we're actually like the ta deciding the winner for this whole challenge stuff. Well, drum roll, drum roll, drum roll, please. Oh, so. Well, they both tried actually. Joshua gave his views. Suspender gave his views. But who would I be choosing? Ah, oh, more. It was hard to choose, though. Ah, but to so avoid being partial, eh? My winner is. Oh my God. Let me, let me, let me just put the drum roll. Grrr. And the winner is Suspender. Victory. So the winner of the whole segment was Suspender. Sure. Because, see, he eh, caught me with that old, how do you fall in love? Oh my, he planned an erotic <laughs> and steaming night. Then I think, well, he tried with the question, like the last question, which was about guessing my number. And I think the first question, so, well, he didn't get the David Doe and Kizani was my favorite artist. No, 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 he didn't get that actually. But yeah, he tried. He tried because I like the video Loki. Well, in case. Ouch. Sorry. We'll cut that part. <laughs> so, just in case you don't know, he's the best in maths, he's the best in love, he's the best in <laughs> basketball. Just. Well, I actually give. See, I actually feel okay giving the W to my brother. Blood is thicker than water. Mm. You should have it while, while it lasts. Okay. <laughs> For my own name, just like, make sure you just click the like button comment and subscribe and also hmm my ladies dear ladies which one are you going to pick between david doe and kiss daniel comment please comment do well to comment to